So, Steve, your neuropathy was absolutely debilitating. Can you tell us what life was like? Yeah, it was. It was. It was hard. It was, uh, you know, just living with pain. I couldn't stand. Couldn't walk. Um, I'm, I'm an active guy, so those kind of things, you know, kind of went away. Uh, I sat around a lot. Didn't want to get up. Didn't want to move around. Those type of things. Well, you said you love coaching softball, I and did. you couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. No. You couldn't even get out of bed. Yeah, in was, a lot of ways. Yes, in a lot of ways, right? So, Dora, you saw what was happening to your husband. Yes. As a wife, how did that make you feel? <laughs> it was hard. It was really hard to see, you know, someone that you love going through so much pain, knowing how active he's always been. So it was it was tough for the entire family. So what exactly was happening to Steve? So your nerves in your feet control two major functions. One is movement, the other is feeling. And with most neuropathies, you're not getting enough blood there, or there's something happening internally to where that blood supply has stopped. And as that happens, that nerve, it dies. It's like a plant, right? If you want a plant to grow, you gotta give it water. Well, when you talk about the nerve, it has to have oxygen, it has to have mm -hmm. all these different things. And when you don't give it to it, it dies and patients suffer. They have numbness, tingling, burning, pain, muscle weakness. I mean, you name it, it just goes on and on. And Steve, you're, you said you're, you couldn't even put your feet on the floor almost. Yeah, it, it, was, it was hard to put shoes on or, or like you said, you know, just stand on the floor or have my feet on the floor. It was just, it was just uh, the, the, the pain. So Dr. Ty, I've interviewed you several times. I kind of know the answer to this, but can you explain to folks why your process works for people while other processes don't? And I know you're very dedicated sure. to making people feel better and get well. Yeah, well, you know, my, uh, what I've done, I spent a lot of time developing this process. Mm -hmm. You know, a lot of patients that come in, they're skeptical because they've been to other doctors and nothing's worked. Well, my process is a proprietary process. It's based on clinical research, clinical outcomes. It's FDA approved, FDA cleared, and really there's proven success. Now, that's not to say we can help everyone because we can't. You know, one out of every three patients that comes in, I cannot do anything mm -hmm. for them. But it's like, Steve, what if we could help you? What if we can't mm -hmm. change your life? I mean, what would what could you do? What would it mean mean for you? And and that's really all we want to do is just help more people. And so, Steve, you came on the show, and Dora, you came yes. on because you wanted to tell other people who may have a problem. Absolutely. What what you've learned? So, what would you tell them? I, I would I would say to uh, to anybody suffering, just to uh, make an appointment and uh, and go see Dr. Ty because he can help. Absolutely. Yes. You second that, Dora? Oh, I do. I definitely <laughs> do. Thank you so much.